There are a number of different antenna types that you might want to use with your access point. One of the most common you'll find is called an omnidirectional antenna. If you've ever purchased an access point and set it up, it probably has an antenna that looks a little bit like this. That's an antenna that takes the signal coming out of that access point and evenly distributes it across all sides of that access point. So you put your access point in the middle, and all of the signal goes out into every direction. It's not at all focused on any particular area. And therefore, it's very simple to set up. You put it in the middle of the floor, you turn it on, and now you don't have to worry about one side of the access point getting more signal than the other. Everybody's signal is going to be evenly distributed right around that antenna. Of course, this brings up a number of problems if you do want to focus that signal. Maybe you'd like to set your access point in the corner and simply have a 90 degree angle into the rest of the floor. Or maybe you need to send the signal out to another building. And in those cases, you'll want to consider consider a different kind of antenna that will be able to focus that signal. A directional antenna will be the perfect choice for focusing that signal, of course. This is a picture of what is commonly called a can antenna because it takes the signal and effectively sends it right through that can out the other side. And now you have a very focused signal coming out of your access point. It can send that information out in a very focused direction. It also listens in that very focused direction. That way you can have other interference that might be behind you. But because your signal strength is focusing in one direction, you can simply have those other signals that might normally be interference now move down to a lower level, and your signal therefore becomes much easier to hear. Antenna performance, if you ever look at these, is measured in something called decibels, and it's abbreviated dB. Every time you take a dB and add 3 dB to it, you have effectively doubled the power. So you can see the scale of decibels is very logarithmic in that way. Every time you see a 3 dB gain, you've effectively doubled how much signal you would be putting into that antenna. Some very common types of directional antennas are listed here. This is a Yagi antenna. It is extremely directional, and these generally have very high high gain associated with them. They can go over long distances. And you'll probably see these on a rooftop. If you ever need to send a wireless signal from one building to another, a Yagi antenna is very good for doing something exactly like that because it is so focused. There's another type of focused antenna or directional antenna called a parabolic antenna. This parabolic antenna focuses also on a single point. It's also receiving the signals across a larger area and focusing them into a single feed horn that might, might be on that antenna right on the front. So the signals are being captured very, very easily by this very large dish and being focused on this single direction right on the end of the antenna. So as you're working with your access points and you're designing exactly where your signals are going to go, you'll want to consider using your omnidirectional antennas or your directional antennas.